All right, we're going to show you how to do a full factory restore on a HP all-in-one Omni 120. This will work with any of the all-in-one HP computers, um, or HP for that matter, uh, Hewlett Packard for that matter, and Compact. So what you want to do is go ahead and turn on your HP, and what you want to do is you want to tap the F8 button. F is in Frank 8. You hit it multiple times. And you might actually have to do this three or four times for to get it to catch. All right, so go ahead, turn it on, and F8. As soon as you see that HP logo, you start tapping. All right, that's great. It caught the first time. What you're looking for is on the upper part where it says repair your computer. If for whatever reason it doesn't have this long list of safe mode and all that, turn it off and do it again until you get repair your computer. You want to select that, and that's going to take you to the recovery process. And uh, the reason for doing this is if you got a, a Trojan horse, or you got a virus, uh, or if you just want to resell it, or give it away to a friend, and you want to clear out all your videos, your photos, your history, and make it like it's fresh out of the box, like when you originally bought it, that's what this does. So again, you tap F8 and it'll take you to the recovery page all right you click next You click OK. Wherever you put, then you want to choose this off option that says Recovery Manager. All right, and then it says, Welcome to Recovery Manager HP tools that let you quickly get your operating system back and running if it ever becomes corrupted. All right, it gives us on the left side, it gives us four options or three options Microsoft System Restore. That's if you want to back it up like a week ago or a month ago or half a year ago before you got uh, some malicious malware or something like that. You can do that. Um, you could do a startup repair if you can't get into your operating system. And the third one is, just, is system recovery. That's the one we choose. And what you're going to do, you could either back up your files first, um, your videos and all that good stuff, or you can choose the second one where you're recovering without backing up files all right and then from there we click next I'm not gonna go ahead and do the next procedure just because uh, I don't want to recover this one because I've already done it um, but the rest is self-explanatory you just walk through the the steps so again if you want to do full factory restore that's how you do it thank you for watching